Greetings, Geishlings. Heishin Prime here, doing another live reaction of One Piece, Chapter 855. Growl. An exaggerated growl. Okay. Cover art for this week. Aw, little law and Corazon. <laughs> and Corazon's on fire again. Why is he always on fire? And Law's just like... <laughs> what do I do? I don't know what they're eating. Potatoes? Anyway. Moving on. I'm glad that there doesn't ever seem to be fan art in this anymore. Oh, Bobbin apparently got back up. Lord Bobbin! Oh, I missed the little thing. A hectic night uh, precedes the wedding ceremony. Lord Bobbin, what in the world was that? I just heard some crazy noise from over there. This hole in the wall. Boing, boing. Oh, here's Bobbin the Fixer. <laughs> He's just a soldier. He's classified as a bishop. Okay. He's not worth as much as I thought. 105.5 billion? Million berries? I, I don't know why. The, uh, the B switch, whatever. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, I'll have to come back for that page. Or that picture. Alright. Bovin! Moing moing. Wait. What? Sound waves started coming out of his mouth, and then the soldier fell over asleep. So, Bobbin has a sleeping power? <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Stand down. He took them all out. Well, one of them looks like they're still standing, but I don't know. I will fix this. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, Sanji's on the run still. Even Hell's demons make appearances at Mama's tea parties. Uh, oh, I, I remember. I was like, what? But then I remembered that. <clears throat> okay, back to the mirror world. Whoa. What should we do? First things first. I'm glad he's still alive. She's gigantic. So that's one of the Yonko. Oh, they're spying in on Big Mom. She apparently took. Wait, oh, we, it is night time. I forget about that. So she's turned in for the night, and so is Proteus and Zeus and Bicorn. I, 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 no. Bicorn is what kind of hat it is, isn't it? Uh, Napoleon. And Brooke even looks like he's asleep because what else is the poor guy going to do? He's just like, I, I don't know anymore. <laughs> she won't let go. Big Mom, why is she sleeping with Brooke in her arms? And Brooke's out cold too. I'm actually impressed he can sleep in that situation. Wake up, Brooke. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Why, why a strange bone creature like that? There's no way Mama would let him go free. But don't you worry. Uh, so she's talking again. Didn't they knock her out? <laughs> uh, I'll get her to drop him real qu or quick enough. Huh? Ma! It's Blaise! Ah! <laughs> Why, you little gag this witch. <laughs> uh, what exactly would Big Mom be able to do? I mean, if Berlay's not, like, touching the mirror, how could she save her? Anyway, so, uh, damn it. Okay, so they gagged her and Diesel and tied them up. Uh, she didn't wake up, did she? Oh, shit. I think she did. 
she blinked. And Chopper's like, ah, she spotted us. Was a fly? <laughs> oh, there's a fly in her room. And she destroyed that little fly. Broke the floor too. Now she's back to snoring. What? What in the world was that? What just happened? What the? And Brooks out like a light. Oh, a fly. Well then. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Brooke. You make good comedy even when it's not a bone joke. Uh, what the? Is Mama being attacked? Oh, crap. Zeus and Prometheus have woken up. And Napoleon can turn into a fucking sword. Holy crap. Yeah. How dare you while she's sleeping. There you are. Wait, did they just kill the already dead fly? And now they're all peaceful again. The floor's on fire, but everything's okay. How in the world are we supposed to save him? <laughs> yeah, it's not looking good, is it? Okay, out in the city. Oh, that's Sanji. I thought it'd be Luffy again. Uh, oh, this is starting to look like Sanji's childhood when he brought his mom that lunchbox or bento box. I always want to say lunchbox because a dog's attacking it and it's raining. Oi, down boy, this ain't food for you. How about, oh, they're back in the mirror world. How about this? Whoa, it looks exactly like him. I found it in an execution room inside the castle. Some seaweed found in the kitchen sanding in for the F. Oh, they're going to make a brook dummy. I can, uh, I can't but see Brooke when I look at it. It does look quite like him, just a, like a fatter version. If we can just switch this thing out for the real guy, I don't think she'll realize we've snatched him from under her nose. Probably. <laughs> oh, probably. Yeah. Challenge one. If you leave Brulee right inside the mirror barrier, you can go in and out as you please, just by touching her. Okay. I'll remember this, damn it. <laughs> Alright, here I go. Okay, so Chopper's going in. Be careful, Broper. Sneak, sneak. Achoo! Wait, who sneezed? Oh, God! <laughs> Chopper nearly dodged the Big Mom slap of death. You idiot. Oh, so it was it Chopper that sneezed? Challenge two. I got this. Oh, so Carrot's going in. Broke. Wake. Holy crap, she got knocked away by Big Mom's sleep bubble. Whatever the, you know, like when they sleep and then all of a sudden, like, snot bubble appears or something. What is that called? Whoa! Uh oh. Zeus woke up from that. You damn fly! He's half asleep when he zaps her. But she dodges that. Challenge three. Warning cake. Oh, she's dreaming of the cake. She's tossing and turning. Oh, so. Pedro didn't get any chance either. Well, this is. Funny chapter. It's sad that it's not working out so well for Brooke. <laughs> and he doesn't even know that it's going on. We've done it. Big Mom's finally let go of Brooke. Okay, we'll go now. Brooke, wake up. We're here to save you. Yawn. Oh, he's awake. The bubble popped. Brooke? What? Well, it's me. <laughs> Gah! A ghost! What? Oh shit, bro. <laughs> you of all people. You're still here? You're a bloody persistent fly. 
Oh, she grabbed Prometheus's face, and it's just kind of, yeah, you know the, yeah. Oh no, this isn't good. Heavenly fire. Good attack for what she did, or name for what she did. How is she gonna have any room left after all of this? But okay. Well, they got away and they kept the dummy so that's not going to move <laughs> well they ended up in the mirror world okay oh is the, or did they leave the dummy maybe they did yeah, I guess maybe that's they tossed it outskirts of sweet city oh I think Sanji made it to the meeting spot, but Luffy hasn't made it. Find Straw Hat, Drizzle Drizzle. I guess they came here to find you. And you sure did go crazy. Oh, it's the enraged army. They're still knocked out. Um, at the moment we have Straw Hat Luffy and Cat Burglar restrain Nazu. Uh, it's Mr. Sombrero Head. Anyway. But didn't you say we'd be waiting for me here? Where are you? Oh, he's searching through the bodies to try and find him. Probably not there. They haven't even shown him yet, so I'm hoping something didn't happen. You, 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 you surprised me. That was the last thing I was expecting. You surprised us for crying out loud. Why'd you scream? We lost, or we almost died. Well, all that aside, I'm very glad to see you all are, you are alive. I thought I was going to die. I'm already dead. Ah, bone jokes. <laughs> I suppose the fact that you set off that security net means that it must have been quite impossible for you to steal a rubbing of the road potoglyph. Road probably one. Yeah. Yeah, but no matter. It's in his head, isn't it? Because I, I've heard from both Roger and some patch and from their readers have said the same thing and uh, or watchers. Well, readers. But yeah. So it's probably in his head and maybe Brooke just forgot. But no matter. It was an impossible task. I'm sorry to have put you all, th all your lives in danger. No, not at all. P yep, there it is. <laughs> I saw the picture. No, not at all. Please, this was all for us in the first place. As you said, because we snuck in. With just the two of us, this was a once-in-a-lifetime chance. But n we never end up having to... St or, if we never... If we ever end up having to steal a poneglyph from Big Mom again, I doubt we'll be able to without a full-scale pirate army. Oh, no, he just opened his skull, I guess? Or maybe he's hinting at something, but Jembe and Carrot are kind of freaked out by it. Oh, here you are. Yep, there it was. Ah, there you are, the rubbing. Anyway, as I was saying. Huh? Ah! I'm glad to see you too are alive. What? <laughs> we definitely were backed into a corner there. I couldn't think of anything other than a decoy plan either. Wait, just a minute, Brooke. What are these? Don't tell me these pieces of paper. Huh? They're the rubbings of the poneglyph. Let me tell you, I only managed to get them by the skin of my teeth. The very m moment I had finished rubbing the last one, Big Mom and of all people showed up and oh so he had enough time between beating the soldiers that were in the treasure room and between when Big Mom showed up okay good lord those are some big rubbings but I guess it makes sense but how did they fit in his head <laughs> so you actually had them even with our commanders there and everything her commanders God, I can't read. Uh, the poneglyphs that the other Yonko want nothing more than to get their hands on. 
you actually got them. Ah, yeah. What in the world? He stole our poneglyphs? Oh shit, now Burley and Diesel know. Wow, well done, Brooke. Yo ho. <laughs> uh, getting a nice hug from Nami. Uh, even family is not so easily given entry into the Hall of Treasures. What a guy. Yo ho ho. Wait, so do you think you can show me your panties then? Oh god, Brooke, no. You, you, you stepped over the line, Brooke. <laughs> Uh, that's one objective down. Now all we've got left to do is bring back Sanji. Oh, the, oh, now I think I get it. The growl is Luffy's stomach. He's finally made it. Huh? Sanji's crying. And there's Luffy. He's basically collapsed. Oh, he's up against uh, King Bomb. That, that's where he was. The Rumble of Hope. One Piece, Chapter 855, End. Well, yep, that was the end of it. Alright, well, so theories came true with the Brooke had it in his head all along thing. And I, I loved this chapter, it was too good. Yeah, between all the, the fly. Why she thought they were a fly. <laughs> uh, all three, well, four of them, really. And, well, even Brooke, so five. But anyway, so thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Keyshlings roll out.